yes, we are back again with a, another project. Today I'm going to be making some candle holders. I finally found these at my Dollar Tree and I went ahead and grabbed as many as I needed. And um, I'm so excited to make this because I have been waiting for a while to make this project. So things that I have here are just some candle holders. I have six of these and then I picked up three of these. And the reason why I chose these is because this is my accent color throughout my house and I just love this color. So I'm gonna go with those. I'm gonna move these out of the way for right now so you guys can see what I'm doing. Um, another thing that I have here is some white paint because I'm going to be painting them. I have some Vaspar antique glaze. I use that on everything. And then I have some matte finish spray. And I have some brushes. I have E6000 and my hot glue gun heating up right here as well. Thank you guys for coming back for another video. If you're new here, my name is Jessica. Now I'm gonna start putting the E6000 on and then I'm gonna follow with the hot glue and I'm going to glue two of them together. I'm just scraping off the edges a little bit. I'm just gonna do that to all three and glue them. Right here, I'm just scraping off the extra glue and then I'm going to start painting them. Now a paintbrush would work a lot better. I do so many projects that I did not realize I was out of my paintbrushes. So I'm trying to use this little one that I have and it was just taking a lot longer. I do end up using the bigger brush and I did put about three coats of white on here. I did not show me putting on all three coats simply because I did not want y'all just sitting here watching me put on three coats of white paint but I did put on three coats and I did let them dry in between coats as well. This is after all three coats have dried. I am going in with my antiquing glaze. And my son is in the background. He likes to sit and watch me when I'm doing projects. So if you see me talking, I am talking to my son. Now that they all three have been antiques, I'm gonna go ahead and spray them down with the matte finish. I did about three coats of that as well. Now I'm going to glue on the little candles. I'm using E6000 and the hot glue again. And I did realize after I was done that some of the candles were not even, so I had to take them off and redo them. But overall, they came out exactly how I wanted them to. I absolutely love them. If you guys like the way they came out, then go ahead and give this video a big thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe and also turn on your post notification bell. That way you don't miss out when I post new videos. Thank y'all for watching and I will see you guys on the next one. Alright, bye y'all. This could be good for me. Lately I was feeling like I need a purpose.